Miller greetings, Mary Tubians. Welcome back to Harvest Moon, the Winds of Anthos, where we are desperately trying to make money as rapidly as possible. Um, I have done some research between episodes. I've found out that we can go fishing in the desert when it rains. So we're going to have to check on the weather in the desert um, so that we can get those rainy days. Apparently, there are also fishing spots at the um, Volcano Summit, so we might check those out. And there's apparently a really good run just outside of Herbstburg. So we're probably going to be a bit fishing heavy for a couple of days. I feel like that hurts me more than you, so hopefully everybody has fun and enjoys this. Taking care of the critters. Should probably make some more feed. I'm stuck. Okay, pet echo. Really, guys, can we unstick me, please? Who am I missing? Nitta. Oh no, Wilson. Hey, Wilson. Have I, have I patted Nitta? I don't remember. Have we seen Nitta? Yeah, we did Nitta. Okay. Everybody out. Go forth and graze. All right, let's check our lotuses because we're going to need more. See how much money we made yesterday with all that ore and stuff. And we've got to go check our berries. Then we might check out this fishing spot at Herbstburg. Oh, uh, is it Truffle Day? I feel like it's Truffle Day. Okay, we've got a sale. Another 13k. Alright, I'm gonna make some coconut juice. Um, because if we end up in the desert, then we're gonna need the cool coconut juice. Which do I have more of right now? Uh, for two oranges, let's make those. And down, 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 coconut milk. Ah, okay, we actually had more oranges than coconuts, that's good. Alright, that should keep us nice and cool. Now we'll head over to Breezy Plains, water the strawberries. I wish I could make strawberry juice as a cooling recipe. Hmm. Might stop up there. Uh, yesterday we did, yesterday in game, we bought a bunch of bait. Uh, so hopefully that should give us some... All right. Strawberries are still flashy. Seriously though, why are they still flashy when nothing else is? I've done a harvest on them now. Nah, eh, no well. Such is the way of things, I guess. Uh, might grab some apples. We haven't been down here for a while, so... And then we will check the desert. Well, we'll go home. We'll get our stuff. I might grab Echo. And then... Oh, are any of you sparkly? No. 
we will... Um, I might also do a bit of a sort through and sell off like the spare piles of stuff today as well. Like we've got 99 plus on quite a few things. Alright, those apples should keep me energised. And I still don't know what I've got highlighted over there. But that's okay. Alright, let's go home. Because I need to start the fishing. Alright, all of our stuff is ready. All right, first off. Oh, oh, we've got water here. Okay, all right, all right, all right. And we've got truffles. Echo. First, we're going for the truffle. Then we're going to go check out that pond. That has now formed. Let's have some coconut juice. Hey Echo, look, I'm taking you home. This is where we met. Isn't that cool? Now. Oh. <gasps> All right. Down. All right. Let's go for the rare fishy. Come on, rare fishy. Look, you're all sparkly coming. Come on, fishy. I'm dying trying to catch you. Come on. I cannot afford any more of this bait. Well, I, I can. I can afford a lot more of this bait, but... Why are you so slow? And done. Oh, come on! Why are you being a sod? I don't like these fishies. Yeah. All right. Where was the next one? How do I get up there? Um. Uh, let's go this way. So it's going to be a bit of effort. Um, I go around. And then there should be an up. Oh, there we go. Oh, the desert's navel. Apparently we hadn't unlocked this. Hello, desert's navel. Um, I see no fishies. And I see a sparkle on the water. But no fishies. That's weird. Alright. Oh, okay, there's one down here. Good. But it also doesn't have a fish spot. Apparently.
Uh, oh. Okay, there are fishes over there. But first, let's go get the truffle that we know is going to make us money. And hello, truffle. I still need to work out the pathways to the ones in the volcano. Um... Oh, you are a sparkly fishy. Let's give it a try. Come on, fish. I'd like to actually catch you this time, please. Please let me catch you. Please, pretty please, let me catch you. I need money. Which means you need to behave. That's come on, come on, come on, come on. So close, so close. No. What have I got to do to catch these swords? All right, let's try the desert thing that somebody mentioned. The volcano thing. All right, so apparently somewhere in here is a way to fish. If this doesn't work, I'm going back to Herbsburg. Alright, I see lots of lava. I see a blue velociraptor. Is there like a water spot? Or there's a sprite? Um, is there anything along here? No, okay. I was lied to. There may be options later on. Alright, to Herbsburg. We're going home. Because I need to catch some fishies. I really don't want to. I would much rather do anything else, but... I've made no money today. I've made no progress today on anything. Which way is the sea? This way. Ah. Right. Now let's try using some of our fancier bait. Um, yeah, let's try the level two. We, we've, we've not used the level two before. Maybe this will catch us two starfishes. I don't know if there's anything above a two starfish. I know we've seen two starfish. Let's fight. Alright. Red Barracuda. The most expensive of all barracudas. Its flesh is fatty and has a strong flavour. Ooh, that's a big one. Alright, let's try that again. And come on. And you're tiny compared to your brother. Sleepy time, and I've only caught two fish. This is not great. I really should start like spread cheating out. Oh, actually, I'll check the wonderful folk at Fogu. Fogu? And see if they've actually got a spread sheet of fish value. Oh, what are you? Red Sea Bream. A saltwater fish with a distinctive red body. With its sturdy jaws, it can chew up the shells of shrimp, crabs, and other sea life. Alright, you're a bit vicious. Come on. That's it. Notice me. 
notice me? And... Have value, please. I really need to work out how to catch those sparkly fish. Do I need a better fishing rod? Is that the problem? More barracuda. Pick up. Oh, another fishing spot. Okay. I was just going to pick up the clams, but we're going to do some more fishing. Ooh. Geoducks. I can use those to make more bait. All right, let's see how this lot react to one star bait. Oh, well, level one bait, I should say. Well, it gets noticed. That's the important part. They've all noticed it. And the moon is coming for me. You would think that the best places to fish would be the weird places like the volcano. There'd be a pond up there or... Or something. Maybe I should have tried for more options in the desert. Oh, what are you? Snakehead. A large freshwater fish with a head like a snake. It could even breathe air, though only slightly. I'm fishing in the sea. What are you, what, what, what are you doing here? This, this is not freshwater. This, this is nothing like fresh water. Would help if you actually fought fish running. Oh. Were you about to swim onto the shore? Red bream. A saltwater fish with large eyes. It's very popular for its bright appearance and good taste. Nice. Let's put you in roughly the path. Come on. I need to go home at some point. Very soon, because I don't want to oversleep. Pay attention, Ronan. You're another red sea bream. All right, this will be the last one, and then we will go home and do all of this again tomorrow. Woo. Woo. Fight the fishy. Reel the fishy. Oh. There wasn't a second fight the fishy. I was expecting a second fight the fishy. Alright, let's go see what this lot are worth to us. Thank you for waiting so patiently, Echo. I know you're hungry and you want to go home and go to bed. You know what? So do I. Just have to hope that some of these fishies are worth it. Put you away. What happens if I just leave Echo outside all night? Will she put herself away? I got myself stuck. Huh. That looked weird. It's like something's not spawning somehow. Alright. Red sea bream. Eh. Oh, the snakehead's worth a bit. Red frame. Red barracuda's worth a bit. Two stars, almost 5k. Alright, that's, that's not a bad day's work. That, that'll net us a bit of cash. Last time I looked, we are in the 50s, I think. Maybe everything, just the lighting is weird because it's so close to midnight. And there's no moon or something like that. Ooh, there's a sale today, but I don't know where. Oh! Three days till the mining meets. 
I should think about building my stamina. Which means I should find some more wisps. Eh. Not that much of a hurry, honestly. Mining will get us some points with our beloved, but not a huge amount. I know I should be focusing on growing things for the quests and stuff, but... Yeah, it's like, why is there suddenly no light in here? Is it seasonal change? Have, has the game just glitched weirdly? It, it's it's like somebody went around and turned all the lights off. Weird. What is going on, Harvest Moon? I've not seen you do this before, I don't think. Why am I harvesting eggs? People who actually own or live on farms, do you harvest the eggs or do you just gather them? Uh, let me through. Uh oh, Echo's having a fit. Okay, let's clean up that. Yeah, it's like all my ground textures have gone. There's gotta be a reason for that, right? Is that just me? Am I the only one seeing that as weird? Fairly sure I've patted everybody else. Alright, let's water the lotuses and try and work out what the heck is going on with my game. And it's not as sunny. Is that the problem? Well, the sun's out. Maybe staring at all the bright lights did something? Maybe it's my monitor? Maybe it was all the slooping around. 25k! We're at 94k. Alright. Let's come back out. Okay. We've got no water here. That's good. That is actually good. Oh, uh, there was... I saw a sparkle up here, didn't I? Yeah, I'll have to go there. Alright, we will try that after we have been to Breezy Plains. And here's hoping things will reload properly. Not really, no. I am weirded out at this point. I don't know why I did that. Alright, we've got spare white berries now, that's good. Um. Yeah, that's just... Everything looks weird and I don't like it. It really is... I can't tell if it's the ground textures have gone funky or if somebody just turned off the sun. Alright, that looks like too far away to fish from. Where's the closest point to this little... sod? Alright, come here, fish. You are the only fish in this pond. You are coming home with me. Come on. Don't just ignore me. I don't want to be here any more than you do. Okay, this is your home. You might actually want to be here. Alright. Gotta be paying attention. Cannot afford to let this sucker go. Please stop fighting. No. How am I meant to 
Get to assault. And the obvious answer is get better. Alright, we'll try and see if we can find whatever's going on at the summit. And I do think for the next episode I might try and find the paths to those other truffles. Um, there was no water up here, so logically they've got to be in the lava. Um, I'm not sort of seeing... Oh, wait, is that a fish? That is a fish silhouette. All right, let's just try with regular bait because they just look like normal sized fishies. Really hard to see them though. And my bobber. Okay. Were these guys here yesterday and I just missed them? Yep, 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 that's fine. I'll drink some coconut juice in a sec. Is fishing worth dying for? Blue crayfish. It's huge. Um, look, you guys are a bit further out, so I might need to throw the bait further than I would generally prefer to. But we might go back to Herbsburg after this, because that did net us a bit of coin. What would that one fish be worth almost 5k? Oh! Lava crayfish. A crustacean that lives in lava. Because they evolved to be able to live in lava, their shells are very hard and difficult to cook. Hmm. Lava craze it is. Alright, so yeah, we've got at least two silhouettes left. Keeping an eye on my hearts. Lava mosquito fish. A fish that lives only in lava. Small, hard, and difficult to cook. So I'm gonna guess that these guys are not gonna be great for food. I love the fact that my fishing rod hasn't melted or anything. Don't just stare at it. Little blue crayfish. Alright, no other fish is available that I can see. Um, now there were a couple of ore nodes. Let's grab these. I don't know what sort of ore these are, but while I'm here... Oh, given how much effort they're taking, they should be something important. Have we had a pop yet? I'm going to need to stop and drink something. Anything? Wow, what is this stuff? Come on. I need a better hammer. I did all of that for one or a calcum ore. Um... Yeah, I don't really have any other food right now. Alright, let's get this one. Gotta be more R, Calcum. Where was that little nook where we got stuck? I feel like when we were trying to find a summit one day, there was a little nook that had like five or six nodes. Um, and a wall that implied I needed to do something to get home. Where was that? I wish it was not so easy to get so lost in this place. One more. There we go. Alright, let's get out of here. Before we melt. There's a fishing spot there as well. Oh, and there. How do I even get to that place? 
I suppose I could try for this one from here, which gets me outside at least for a minute and I can sure oh wow heavy weather I can shore up my supplies a bit um, it's not raining in the volcano it did look like it was going to be straight along the path right like I, I wasn't going to have to go into the volcano to get to this one Fairly sure that's what it looked like. Um, or yeah, apparently if I just keep following the path around, I will get to the magical mythical fishing spot. Oh, hopefully it's on the right level though. This is always a problem is, yes, I can see the spots up here, but, oh, flaming mushroom. Oh, there we go. Yes. And we've got some more ore notes, so we might try those out. And now, let's see. What level three bait gets us with this weird little pool of fishies? None of them seem to have sparkles. And they're a little bit easier to see than the other guys. Okay, you're a fighter. You're a real fighter. Okay, you can stop fighting now. You've proved your point, weird lava fishy. You are another lava mosquito fish. Alright, let's go back to the level one bait because I don't want to waste the good stuff. Ah, uh, gotta keep an eye on that and an eye on the time. This better be worth it. From a super sparkly perspective. Alright, you're another lava crayfish. I do not look happy. I am honestly not surprised by that. Given that I'm just slowly melting myself to death to catch fish. All of this better be worth it. You are a lava crayfish, okay. Last cast, and then I'll go check out what those ore nodes are. Um, and then we might call it. Is it going to be worth saving up to get the better fishing rod so I can make money faster through fishing? How much did it cost again? It was like 10k. My bag is full. Problem solved. Give me my fish. These look like they're going to be a bit cheaper. Ah, gold is never a bad thing. Feel like I can get it for less effort elsewhere. Um, another fishing spot there that's not really worth trying for. Gotta work out how to get to those truffles. Um, that one is probably too far at this point. Yeah, let's just call it and go home. We've had a big couple of days out upon the trails of the fishies. Hi everybody! Uh, let's see what all those lava fish were worth. 
Oh, blue crayfish is kind of useless. Even at two stars. Lava mosquito fish, 500. Now that's more like it. 16.50 for those guys. That's not... Uh, I feel like we could have done better. Alright, let's go see what we've got excess of that I can sell off. I know it's not going to be worth much, but at this point, every little bit helps. So what are we worth at the moment? 94. Put you away, put you away. I feel like we don't have that many apples at the moment. Alright, what am I doubled up on? You guys can come out. Um, you guys can come out. It's probably just, I, I might actually just take these out and eat them. I think I'm going to get more value if I do that. Um, I wish I knew what I could use that for. And gold, silver, corn, and uh, there's just so much random stuff here that I've got no idea what to do with. Uh, let's take out the two star goby. We're keeping the anchovies. All right, we'll sell that lot off, and then we will call this an episode. It's been a fairly big day. We've discovered some new tricks for fishing not many just how to spot fish in lava I feel like might have some value later on eh, $600 fish not really huge but this 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 you know four or five K in there at least which is better than kicking the teeth gets us closer to our hundred and fifty thousand dollar we're actually gonna need more than that uh, because I'm, if I'm going to have to buy the lumber, we're going to need maybe closer to 200k. Uh, we'll, we'll see what happens. Um, until next time, it's going to be Ronan Tia signing off, and I will catch you in our next episode.